Safety professionals are essential during periods of prosperity and growth, but their mission becomes all the more critical in times of adversity. 2020 brought with it an unprecedented challenge that elevated the importance of health and safety in every type of environment. And at the forefront of all the changes we see globally is the safety and health community. Their dedication to the greater good by ensuring the safety and health of those within their organizations and beyond is a testament to our industry. Whether they are spearheading new research, developing sustainable processes, or providing preventative measures and guidelines, we are proud to honor those safety professionals who have gone above and beyond to grow and enhance the profession. Welcome to the ninth Annual Award of Excellence presented by BCSP. Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Christy Uden, Interim CEO for the Board of Certified Safety Professionals. It is my honor on behalf of BCSP and our Board of Directors to introduce the ninth Annual Award of Excellence Program and what is our very first virtual award ceremony. The decision to hold the ceremony virtually this year was made to ensure the health and safety of everyone who would otherwise be in attendance. The pandemic has brought many unique challenges over the past year, but we hope that with this virtual ceremony, we can honor the 2020 recipients in the way that they deserve. I now introduce our host, David West, BCSP Examination Director and former member of the BCSP Board of Directors. Thanks, Christy. I'm excited to honor all of our Award of Excellence winners today. At this time, we would like to take a moment to acknowledge our past Award of Excellence recipients, as well as our current and past BCSP directors that may be watching. Thank you for the continued work that you do to advance the safety profession. Now, we would like to invite the 2020 Board President to say a few words, Mr. Mario Varela. Greetings. Since 1969, BCSP has certified remarkable individuals who lead with professionalism in the safety, health, and environmental industry. Today, we would like to recognize several practitioners who have excelled in their commitment to our profession. I would like to personally congratulate all of our 2020 award recipients, and I hope that you will enjoy this year's Award of Excellence ceremony. Thank you for all you do. Be well and Happy New Year. Thank you. The BCSP Awards of Excellence recognize top CSPs, ASPs, OHSTs, CHSTs, STSs, and STSCs who best represent our certificate's outstanding leadership, knowledgeable expertise, and commitment to the advancement of the SH&E profession. This year, we are proud to recognize five individuals with awards of excellence for their outstanding achievements. We are also delighted to recognize this year's Lifetime Achievement Award recipient. BCSP's Lifetime Achievement Award is given in recognition of a lifetime commitment to the safety, health, and environmental profession. And this year's recipient has played a pivotal role and inspired many with his reverence to the profession. Please join me as we recognize our 2020 award recipients. Our CSP Award of Excellence. Trisha Kagerer is a seasoned, goal-focused safety, risk, and continuous improvement professional with expertise in designing and leading all aspects of performance excellence through safety management. She is an expert in creating and leading high-performing risk and safety strategies that ultimately reduce the cost of risk for an organization while instilling a culture of excellence focused on enterprise risk management. Her risk expertise includes evaluating and designing risk strategies to determine the best possible course of action on risk financing decisions, including retention, finance, self-insure, and risk transfer options for multi-million dollar construction organizations across the United States. Trisha is the EVP of Risk Management for Jordan Foster Construction, a large construction organization that performs civil, multifamily, and general contracting across Texas where she leads the risk management, safety, and leadership teams. She has developed expertise and speaks regularly on the human side of crisis management, emergency response, best practices, education across cultures, servant leadership, and diversity. 
She holds a master's degree in dispute resolution from Southern Methodist University in Dallas, Texas, and her Bachelor of Science in Business Administration and Bachelor of Arts in Communication, Public Relations, from Regis University in Denver, Colorado. In 2020, she authored the book, The B Words, 13 Words Every Woman Must Navigate on the Journey to Self-Defined Success, where she highlights challenges and breakthrough strategies for women entering non-traditional roles in the workplace. Trisha's professional credentials include CPCU, CSP, CRIS, ARM, AIC, licensed Texas claim representative and commercial agent, and served as a construction panel arbiter with the AAA. Thank you so much for the honor of receiving the BCSP Award of Excellence. I'm humbled and very excited about the recognition. I'd like to thank my family, Marcus Kegerer, my husband, and my grown kids, Thomas and Annalise. They've been around for the whole journey and the wild ride. It's been really fun being a working mom and having a profession and a career that I love so much in safety. I was fortunate to stumble into safety way back when, um, over 20 years ago. In fact, it was 20 years ago that I pursued my CSP designation, and it was the best decision I've ever made. I would encourage anyone that is looking and considering a career in safety to go ahead and pursue their designation through BCSP. It does make a difference. It opens doors, and it wouldn't, I wouldn't be where I am today if it weren't for taking those steps and getting that education. I'd also like to thank um, all the folks at Jordan Foster Construction, uh, Darren Woody, John Goodrich. Thank you for opening the doors for me all those years ago where the, when there were no women in safety and especially not in construction. Thanks for believing in me and giving me the opportunity to have a career that I love so much. For any woman considering a career in STEM or safety or construction, I say go for it. I'm an example of how the world needs more women in our industry. We need women in every role in the field, in the trades, and also in the executive leadership, um, in the boardroom, making decisions. If I can do it, so can you. Thanks for to everyone for this honor. Um, I'm very excited about the work that BCSP is doing and I'm humbled and grateful. Thank you. our ASP Award of Excellence. Umer Shahab Shahid is a professional chemical engineer with more than 13 years of experience in the chemicals, petrochemicals, mining, and oil and gas industries. His experience includes roles in HSE management systems, process safety management systems, project management, HAZID, HAZOP, LOPA, SIL, consequence analysis, fire and gas mapping, developing and managing HSE KPIs, OSHA, and NFPA standards. Umer graduated in 2007 from the University of Engineering and Technology in Lahore, Pakistan, and joined Engro Corporation in 2008 as a graduate trainee engineer on a petrochemical complex installation and commissioning project. In 2013, he moved to the oil and gas sector in the capacity of HSE advisor, where he was nominated as a future emerging leader. After three years, he transitioned to a leading position in the first ever open cast mining organization with the task of developing and implementing HSE management systems. He received the Sind Engro Coal Mining Company Excellence Award in 2018 based on his exceptional performance in this role. In 2018, Umer joined a petrochemical complex and currently works as a safety engineer. In his first year, he received commendations for successfully integrating PTW across the organization and for successfully managing queries through the HSSE Support Help Desk. After earning his ASP certification from BCSP in 2015, his thirst for knowledge grew and he decided to continue his education. Over the last five years, he has become a CSP, a CPSP from CCPS, a chartered member of IOSH, a TUV certified FSE, a certified PSP, and a TUV certified IMS internal auditor. Currently, Umer is studying to earn a master's in safety and risk management from Liverpool John Moores University, where he acquired distinctions in two modules in his first year. He was also awarded the Rising Star of Safety in 2019 by the National Safety Council. He encourages others to build their SH&E skills by mentoring prospective BCSP certificates. 
He is a mentor to 10 people interested in BCSP certification and was listed on BCSP's Mentor Honor Roll in 2018 and 2019. In addition, he conducts lectures as an external member to build safety foundations for HSE students. Umer hopes to inspire people to improve their skills and knowledge so we can all work together to build a safer world. Hello everyone, and thank you BCSP for this incredible award. I feel honored and humbled as I offer my utmost gratitude to the BCSP for recognizing my work and bestowing me with the ASP Award of Excellence. This is clearly one of the most significant achievements of my professional career. First of all, the BCSP deserves our appreciation for their contribution to the field of HSE and providing a platform to the safety professionals to enhance their competence to make the world a safer place. It is also pertinent to express my gratitude to my mentors, colleagues and friends, especially Mr. Rasim Prashi, who is an institution within himself, Mr. Abdulaziz Khan, Mr. Athar Zarezvi and Mr. Akil Riaz, whose inspirational leadership and kindness have remained my beacon throughout my career. I hope that this award can inspire others to recognize that investment in HSE is beneficial for both workers and to the business. Because productivity and HSE are essentially two sides of the same coin. One cannot do without the other. As safety professionals, I believe that we have a critical responsibility towards humanity and our one single miscalculation can affect so many lives. Therefore, I for one promise to continue my efforts towards creating a safer and efficient work environment through continuous professional development and by delivering excellence at every opportunity. For me, successful is the person who leaves the world better and safer than they found it. Once again, I am eternally grateful to the BCSP for this honor. Thank you and stay safe. Our OHST Award of Excellence Stephen Mercer, CSP, ASP and OHST has over 25 years of experience in general and construction industries. He currently serves as a Marathon Petroleum HES professional and is an integral part of MPLX SWBU West Texas Midstream Business Division, which provides the company with cryogenic gas plants, compressor stations, meter stations, and pipeline. He provides his safety expertise for the Permian and Delaware Basin regions for the company, covering West Texas and Southern New Mexico. Stephen has been a full-time member of the American Society of Safety Professionals since August of 2011. In May of 2012, he received his OHSD certification, along with completing his associate degree in occupational safety and health from Columbia Southern University in October of that same year. While working full-time in July of 2017, he was able to complete his CSHO at TEEX in general industry, along with several other safety-related industry certifications. In 2017, he earned his ASP and CSP and was identified as a safety hero by iReport Source. He also received the Safe Site of the Year Award while working at the Tesla Gigafactory with Helix Electric in 2017. In 2018, Stephen provided his services to NASA Johnson Space Center for the completion of the first CHP plant, and he was published in iReport Source, writing, Five Steps to Curb Complacency in the Workplace. He also received a Safety Leadership Award in 2018 from Baker Hughes. In 2019, he received a second Safety Leadership Award from Marathon Petroleum. He received his Bachelor's in Occupational Safety and Health from Columbia Southern University in July of 2020, graduating magna cum laude. Stephen has been recognized as a leader in the oil and gas industry with a proven track record of bringing his extensive experience into locations that have reported a higher volume of incidents. He immediately adds value to his team and stakeholders by gaining employee involvement and operations buy-in, which also includes partnering with leadership at all levels within Marathon Petroleum. He sets himself apart from his peers by being a good listener and always being respectful. He is the consummate safety professional that effectively communicates through all levels of the organization and knows how to obtain the right results, being one of general industry's most prolific and decorated safety professionals. Finally, he believes that following several key principles, including guiding, mentoring, leading, training, and communication with the right attitude, provides the right formula for being an integral part and asset to a great organization like Marathon Petroleum. Stephen appreciates the support from his teammates and leaders within the organization, along with every mentor that provided him the push, drive, ambition, and support needed to become a successful asset within the safety and health profession. 
Stephen believes iron sharpens iron and will help the younger generation of safety and health professionals exceed heights only those that trailblaze would appreciate. I'd like to thank the Board of Certified Safety Professionals for the 2020 OHST Award of Excellence. Each board certification represents your commitment, your desire to better yourself within the profession of occupational health and safety. Our goals should line up, and they should be to coach, mentor, lead, guide, train, and communicate within the industry to build better partnerships and relationships, as well as to keep our workforce safe. I challenge each and every safety professional to continue to learn and grow for the rest of 2020 and for years to come. And may God bless. Our CHST Award of Excellence. Jordan Hollingsworth, CSP, CHST, and CUSP, joined the Safety Management Group in February of 2008. He leads a staff of safety professionals and contributes to creating expanded solutions designed to meet clients' unique and evolving needs. He holds a master's degree in occupational safety and health from Indiana State University and most recently completed the executive program through Indiana University's Kelly School of Business. He is committed to serving the community and demonstrates his pledge by being actively engaged in local and national safety committees and participating in multiple industry associations, including the American Society of Safety Professionals, Coalition for Construction Safety, Utility Safety and Ops Leadership Network, Junior Achievement, and Kids Chance. Jordan is a professional member of ASSP's Central Indiana Chapter, where he has served the roles of Vice President, Student Section Liaison, Construction Practice Specialty Special Projects Chair, Social Media Chair, Chapter Delegate, and is currently the Golf Outing Chair. He founded the Future Safety Leaders Scholarship Golf Outing, which has funded more than 20 scholarships to students pursuing a career in safety. He was named the chapter's 2020 Safety Professional of the Year. Recognized as an industry leader, he is the author of many published articles on construction safety and best practices. He was named to the Indies Best and Brightest list in 2018. Jordan values personal and professional growth, creating client success stories, and offering meaningful contributions to the community. Hi, I'm Jordan Hollingsworth with Safety Management Group in Indianapolis, Indiana. It is an honor to accept this award. I am thankful for the Board of Certified Safety Professionals. I'm truly grateful to be considered for this award and appreciate the honor that I have been given. My wife and supportive family, You've been with me on this journey since day one, and I certainly couldn't have done it without you. Safety Management Group. I'm grateful for the opportunity a young 23-year-old was given, as it seems like a lifetime ago. Thank you to Mike Martin, Randy Giesking, and Ryan Graft. Thanks for being mentors, your support, and encouragement throughout the years. Some additional shout outs to Dave Murphy, Troy Ogden, Michelle Marsh, Colin McGrady, Mark Sheehan, John Wolsey, and many more. You've all helped me along the way. But most of all, thank you to my colleagues and all other safety professionals out there. Your efforts are not recognized nearly enough. You're everyday heroes and share a passion in workplace injuries. By working together to further advance the safety and health profession, we will reach zero harm. We win together. Certification has played a very important part in my career. Early on, nearly fresh out of college, I joined an organization that encouraged certifications and promotes personal and professional growth. I probably learned the most about being a safety professional from studying for BCSP exams, as it definitely changed my mindset and thinking. As I've moved throughout leadership positions, I've tried to carry that with me. I've been an advocate for associates attaining certifications, and it's been about that personal and professional growth and helping associates further advance and succeed in their careers. Thank you again for this award. It is truly an honor. Our STS Award of Excellence. Sandra Lavoie, CHST, STS, and CRIS is a risk control specialist for Payne West Insurance in the Pacific Northwest. 
She received her Bachelor of Science in Occupational Safety and Health from Columbia Southern University and has spent the previous 12 years in safety and risk management. Her diverse experience has cultivated a well-respected reputation throughout many industries, her clients, the community, and her colleagues. Sandra began her career in 2002, serving as a project engineer for a specialty and finished contractor in construction. She transitioned into safety in 2008 as a construction safety administrator for a concrete placing company. Beginning in 2008, she focused her safety acumen and commitment to excellence by returning to school at the age of 40 and working full-time as a safety consultant in the construction industry, all while raising her daughter with her husband. During this time, she became heavily involved with the American General Contractors, the American Society of Safety Professionals, the National Association of Women in Construction, and the Board of Certified Safety Professionals. She engaged herself by offering to be a presenter at meetings on safety with the Snake River ASSP chapter and the Idaho AGC Safety Committee, while also serving on various safety committees and volunteering at every opportunity. While serving as a safety consultant and earning her STS and CHST certifications from BCSP, Sandra collaborated with safety professionals, keeping workers safe on multiple projects throughout the Pacific Northwest. She worked on Jack's Urban Meetup Place, one of the largest design-build projects in the Pacific Northwest, and on Zion's Bank, Boise's tallest skyscraper. She was particularly fond of participating in an STS job analysis panel in 2015 with fellow BCSP certificates from all over the US and Canada. It was the first of many experiences where she was able to be of service to BCSP. In 2015, Sandra became the safety director for the Treasure Valley Family YMCA, which broadened her expertise in public safety by working in the nonprofit industry. This period of her safety career was one of significant leadership growth and accomplishments. She graduated from college with her Bachelor of Science in Occupational Safety and Health, continued service with the Snake River ASSP as a chapter officer, and diversified her safety expertise by learning from many risk and safety leaders from around the nation. The mentorship she received during this time was key to her growth in safety and risk management. It guided her to expand her reach to others in the nonprofit sector. Sandra's years of focus, dedication, and commitment to her profession have enabled her to be a part of the Payne West Risk Control Team, where she works in risk management. She is honest, fair, responsible, and a trusted team member, always willing to help address the diverse needs of her clients in agriculture, nonprofits, and residential and commercial construction. Hello, my name is Sandra Lavoie. I am the 2020 BCSP Award of Excellence recipient for the STS. To the board of the BCSP, thank you for choosing me to be this year's recipient. It was a huge honor. I would like to thank a few leadership groups for helping me get to this point. To the Snake River American Society of Safety Professionals, thank you for hosting a class for the STS in 2014 and launching my adventure with BCSP. Susie Vader, your advocacy is so valuable to many of us in our community. To Jeff Wallace and the risk control team at Payne West, I am so grateful for your continual drive for educating all in safety and risk. Thank you for being my workmates. To Brett Myron and the leadership team at Petra, to Stacy Kirkhoff at Zellham, thank you so much for your kind words of endorsement. To Billy Bernasconi and the team at the Treasure Valley Family YMCA. Thank you so much for influencing me to be more of an advocate and inclusive to all. To my mentors and peers. To Bruce Holcroft, I cannot thank you enough for being a wonderful mentor, friend, and coworker. To my friends, Tony, Blythe, Josh, thank you so much for all your time. I appreciate you all. To my family, I love you. And thank you for putting up with my commitment and my passion to my career and my profession. Final words, I guess I would have to say, know who you are, know what you stand for, and always know you add great value to your profession. Thank you. Our Lifetime Achievement Award. Thomas Sisich has been a safety professional for 48 years, beginning in 1972 as a graduate assistant at the Industrial Extension Service at North Carolina State University. Much of his early work in safety was focused on injury and illness reduction in the furniture and textile industries, where missing fingers, severe hearing loss, occupational asthma, and other debilitating injuries and diseases were common. 
During this period, he completed a master's thesis which focused on effective measures to improve safety performance within the furniture industry in North Carolina. Currently, Tom is president of TFC & Associates, a global safety, health, and environmental management consulting firm. He also serves as a strategic board advisor for Aveda LLC, a global provider of technology-based supply chain risk management solutions. He has presented hundreds of courses, seminars, and webinars, including at conferences on five continents. In his corporate career, Tom retired as Vice President of Environmental Health and Safety Global Business Support at the pharmaceutical company GlaxoSmithKline, where he held global EHS responsibilities for 100 global manufacturing sites with 100,000 staff members. He also held safety management positions at IBM and Allied Chemical Corporation and is widely recognized for his extensive experience in safety, health, and environmental management. On June 28, 2016, Tom was installed as the 102nd President of the American Society of Safety Engineers. He is an ASSP Fellow, the Society's highest honor, and served on the ASSP Board of Directors for seven years. He also served on the Board of Certified Safety Professionals Board of Directors and is a past president of BCSP since 1997. He was previously the chairman of the Board for the Manufacturing and Chemical Industry Council of North Carolina, a trade association that represented 70 companies with 70,000 employees. Tom was instrumental in launching the Center for Safety and Health Sustainability, a global nonprofit organization representing over 100,000 OSH professionals worldwide and served as the center's first board chairman. The center is dedicated to advancing awareness of occupational safety and health as a vital aspect of a company's sustainability profile. He is known in the OSH community for his efforts to advance awareness that worker fatalities, serious injuries, and high-risk worker health exposures have material impact on business performance and shareholder value. In 1998, Tom was appointed by President Clinton's science advisor as the business representative to the first United States Climate Change National Assessment and is a co-author of the landmark study, Climate Change Impacts on the United States, published in 2000. He was appointed by three North Carolina governors to serve full terms on the NC Environmental Management Commission, the NC Pollution Prevention Advisory Commission, and the NC Radiation Protection Commission. Tom earned his bachelor's degree from the University of Miami and his master's degree from North Carolina State University, both in industrial engineering. He is a CSP and a CIH, as well as a clinical assistant professor of environmental health sciences at the Tulane University School of Public Health and Tropical Medicine, where he has taught graduate courses in the financial aspects of safety and health. He was recognized by Industrial Safety and Hygiene News as one of the Safety Power 101, the 101 individuals who most influenced the field of occupational safety and health in the United States. It is my great pleasure to accept this Lifetime Achievement Award from the Board of Certified Safety Professionals. I started in the safety profession 47 years ago when the landscape for worker protection was far different than it is today. My first work assignment was to assist the furniture and textile industries in North Carolina to comply with a new law called OSHA. Back in the 1970s, the red badge of courage for workers in those industries were missing fingers, severe hearing loss, occupational asthma, or other debilitating injuries and illnesses. In my nearly 50 years as a safety professional, there have been many people who have had a significant impact on my career. It would be impossible to list them all, but I'd like to highlight four groups. From its humble beginnings in 1969, BCSP has progressed, to become a globally respected credentialing organization. And my BCSP certification in 1977, by examination, was a major step in my professional development. Years later, when I was particularly honored when I was elected to the BCSP board and, and then selected as the BCSP president where I had the pleasure to work with the then executive director, Roger Brower, a giant of the safety profession. Second, I'd like to thank the members past and present of the American Society of Safety Engineers, now ASSP. In 1973, when I joined the North Carolina chapter of ASSE 
and the only chapter I've been a member of, there were a number of senior members who uh, are no longer with us, but who mentored and encouraged me to make safety a career. I only wish I could thank them personally today. They would have been very proud to see their mentee on that day in June of 2016 in Atlanta, Georgia, be introduced as the 102nd president of the American Society of Safety Engineers. Through my 47 years of membership with ASSP, I have had I have many lifelong friends and professional colleagues whom I've had the privilege to share the mission of improving the safety and health of workers around the world. Next, I would like to thank the people that I was entrusted to lead in my career, whether they were employees or volunteers. I may have had shortcomings as a manager, but the people who looked to me for leadership understood that I always had their best interests in mind. When people know that you sincerely care about them and their well-being, they will run through walls for you and make you look much better than you ever deserved. Final group I'd like to thank is you, the collective body of the safety profession. There are times when it is very difficult being a safety professional. However, throughout my career, I've always been able to be refreshed by our network of like-minded professionals. I can't personally thank everyone who has helped me achieve this honor, but I, I can thank you for being part of a professional body that has helped me achieve much more than I could have individually. And last and not least, there is one person I need to thank personally, and that is Erica, my wife of 47 years. It is no coincidence that my years in the safety profession and of marriage are the same. It's not always being easy being a safety professional and having family support network to get through the frustrating times for me was essential. So thank you, my dear, for being my partner in my life's journey of striving to help workers return home safely every day. I close by once again thanking BCSP for recognizing for recognizing me for this honor of the BCSP Lifetime Achievement Award, which I'm holding here in my hand. Thank you again. And now a message from the BCSP Foundation. BCSP Foundation is proud to be a part of the BCSP Award of Excellence Ceremony. As you may know, BCSP Foundation rests on the bedrock of BCSP's commitment to supporting a community of certified safety practitioners, and we are dedicated to the achievement of safety as a global core value. As we recognize the power of philanthropy to harness the forces for change, the BCSP Foundation serves as a vehicle for widespread impact, making investments and working with strategic partners to step into the unknown and seek audacious solutions to problems impacting the field of safety. What does this actually look like? Investing in three key areas. Professional advancement, where we support students with scholarships, the Certified Safety Practitioners Fund, helping companies and individuals pursue certification, continuing education. Research and innovation, funding for thesis and dissertation, access to capital for innovation and early stage research, and hosting the Research and Innovation Summit. We held the inaugural in 2019 and look forward to seeing you in August of 2021. Youth Safety, where we work with outreach and engagement, talking about careers and the profession, where we also provide basic safety education. What does it take to realize the vision of safety as a global core value? It takes you. Sharing your knowledge, experience, and financial support the work of the foundation lives in the heart of a community, individuals coming together in pursuit of a greater good, a safer tomorrow. Together, we serve the needs of the safety practitioners, invest in the future of the field, and build consensus across a framework of values designed to advance the global dialogue around safety as fundamental to the individual worker, the health and well being of the community, and essential to a vital economy. We appreciate you and the investments that you make to help us advance the safety profession of tomorrow.
BCSP Foundation is proud to work with industry partners to invest in resources that create opportunities for professional growth. Through a commitment to training and education, we build the pipeline necessary to support industry and advance the profession. The following video highlights one such partnership. Through recent efforts, BCSP Foundation and American Safety Group have worked together to provide safety training and career opportunities to United States military veterans as they re-enter the workforce. One thing that I've learned in the military is really trust my gut instinct. It's gave me the confidence to lead my safety team, lead them from the front to ensure we accomplish the task at hand. Being in the military and working in helicopter squadron, there was a requirement for a safety representative for each squadron. So when given the opportunity, I took advantage of the situation and that's how I began my career in safety. Here at ASG, we offer our refocused veteran safety training program. We team up with TRS program at Camp Pendleton. This gives us the ability to connect with veterans a year prior to their separation date. So SG is veteran owned, so you know we, we are veterans, we're veteran operated, so the veterans are always welcome and we'll always support them to come into this profession. Every job site is different, so there's different tasks, different jobs, so everything changes. Nothing's ever the same, so you're constantly coming up with new, new ways of uh, applying safety procedures and policies. Military and safety careers have a lot in common. In both careers, you're always paying attention to details, and instead of looking for Cavalars and flak jackets, you're inspecting hard hats and safety vests. Once a veteran has completed our vetting process and our training, we connect them with companies that are interested in hiring those vets. As a safety professional, it's crucial to manage your training and experience as you evolve in a career in safety. What BCSP has done is manage a way to mesh those two together and become a staple in the safety community. We have uh, continuing education uh, through the BCSP. Education is, is key to continue growing. The way we apply BCSP as a profession to our, to our management is we make it a requirement. It is also encouraged for all our team to enroll in BCSP to better themselves and our company. As a leader in applying uh, BCSP credentials, we try to offer different type of uh, credentials. We strive to not just be at one credential, we try to get multiple credentials. And we become more valuable to customers, to construction companies, uh, one for the education, for the knowledge. The BCSP offers that, so we are able to bring that to the table, to our management and also our clients. Everything that you learn in the military can cross over into the civilian world. It's a great uh, foundation uh, into the safety profession. Congratulations to all of our 2020 Award of Excellence recipients and our Lifetime Achievement Award recipient. We are truly grateful for all of the amazing work that they have done and continue to do as safety leaders. Thank you all for joining us for today's ceremony.